Black Lives Matter. This is the awakening of a never-ending battle. If you're choosing to stay silent because it makes you uncomfortable, you are part of the issue. Open up the conversation, challenge privileged worldviews. If we say Black Lives Matter and you respond all lives do, here's a preview of why that can't be true. To insist that it's all or nothing only adds to the problem. We are not equal until we are all held accountable. And with an abundance of senseless hate, racial inequality seems insurmountable. A boy should not have to worry about whether he will make it home safely after a trip to the store. Trayvon Martin. A young black life lost while his killer gets a pardon. In a world full of hate and pain, when will love finally reign? How can we do good when our black brothers and sisters still feel so misunderstood? A man should be able to go for a run without being attacked and murdered. Ahmaud Arbery. But when you turn on the news, it seems like they're making a mockery. All lives can't matter until black lives do. But black lives are being threatened in a way that white lives never have in this country. How can actual change happen when our leaders are so power hungry? To make a difference, we have to vote. But first, here are some important things to note. Voter suppression uses legal tactics to make it harder for people to vote. Get educated, make a plan, be prepared, and follow through. These steps may be our only hope. Gerrymandering has been happening for years, creating an abundance of fears. How can marginalized groups have their voices heard when officials manipulate boundaries without a single word? Finally is the issue of accessibility. How can one vote without reliable mobility? Why is it that some voters wait in line for 11 hours while others are in and out? This has to symbolize the imbalance of power. If you're choosing to stay silent, check your privilege and your morals. How has such inequality and hate become so normal? We need change. Staying silent supports the oppressors. A human is a human. No one is lesser. We cannot let discomfort and ignorance prevent us from advocating for those who live in danger. A woman should be able to sleep in her home without being murdered. Breonna, Breonna Taylor. Taylor. We treat racism like a fad instead of a disease that eradicates millions of people. And without a cure, this disease is lethal. A man should not have to beg to breathe. George, George Floyd. Floyd. Performative activism will not fill this void. No justice, no peace, until we are all treated the same. We will forever say their names.